Hey Laura, Kelsey here at Mixed Digital Marketing. Just want to leave you a quick video and in terms of SEO strategies we recommend you doing to your website to help you ranking higher in Google. So we'll go over three things. The first is content, second is backlinks, third is citations. So content just refers to words on the page. And so within Google's algorithm, it can't determine how nice the design is of a website. So all it can really rely on are the, the words or the content that's there. So in terms of the home page, we recommend 1,000 to 1,500 words and each additional page we recommend 500 to 750 words. And so if we go through here, on your homepage. So although it's a nice, easy, simple design, you can see that there aren't quite enough words or content here um, to get to that 1,000 word mark. And so what I recommend you doing is just kind of adding some more content in terms of paragraphs, but not just any words, but the right keywords. And so you might be wondering, okay, well, what are the right keywords? How do I find those out? So we use a software called um, all reps. And so within all reps, I'm allowed to put in any website on the web and it gives me some ratings and sort of the power of what your website is presenting right now. And so here you can see that, um, that you have a rank in the millions, but we're talking about billions of websites. So this rank doesn't really matter too much. What we really care about is everything to the right. And here you can see that your UR rating, and your DR rating are all pretty good um, already, which is um, pretty impressive. Your, so your rating is from zero to 100. UR rating determines the overall power of your website, primarily your homepage. And that is in terms of the on-site SEO as well as the off-site SEO. So on-site SEO um, includes the content as well as some of the internal linking between pages and so on and so forth. Then the off-site SEO is where it's backlinks. So and that, the DR is purely a rating of how strong the backlinks are that are coming to your website. So I know here you can see backlinks and they're in or over 3,000, but really what we care about are referring domains, because these are the, the websites that have backlinks referring your site. And so we care about that because it doesn't matter if you have a thousand backlinks on one website, you get power only once. And so we want to make sure that you have more referring domains. And so to go even further, we care about do follow backlinks. And so here you can see of the 135, you have 95 do follows, which is pretty good. And of those, the stronger those websites are, the stronger um, or higher your DR rating becomes. And so being at 31 is also a pretty good standpoint, but um, obviously there's room for improvement. And as you get higher, you'll start noticing that you'll start ranking for more organic keywords, but also ranking higher for those keywords. And so in terms of, I typed in family law attorney, Austin. So this search is getting 450 searches per month, according to our reps. And so here you can see that there's the Google ad section, which people are paying a premium for to be on the top of this. And so, but typically it said that you can get about 20% of the search volume, but that leaves 80% for the rest of the field. So we have 40% for the map pack and then 40% for the organic search. And in order to appear in the top three of the map pack, usually the, the number one thing is where your organic ranking is. And then the number two thing is your citations. And so citations are online directories like Yellow Pages, Facebook, Yelp, wherever you have your business name, address, and phone number exactly as you have it set up in Google My Business. And it's very important that they're set up exactly the same or else you won't get proper credit for your citations. And so we use a different software um, that allows us to see how many citations these competitors have and we make sure we at least get double of what they have. And so as we scroll down here, I wanted to just go through um, a competitor of yours in, in order to determine what they're doing differently that's allowing them to appear pretty high in organic as well as in the math pack. And so here we have Evans Family Law Group. And you can see here that they have a pretty good amount of content kind of layered throughout their, their website here. And not only do they have good content, but they, they do have um, some optimizations around the words and, and keywords that they have. And so I also type them into, oh, no, not that one. I also type them into RFs and you can see that they have a slightly higher UR rating, but you are also higher in domain rating. So this just tells me that with some optimizations around your content, you should be able to start ranking a lot higher in a big search like family law attorney, Austin. And so those are some quick, SEO strategies we recommend you doing to your website. If you want to learn more about what we can do, please visit www.mixeddigitalmarketing.com. Thank you.